What is today on today's situation? Welcome everyone to today's situation where we answer what is today and what happened on this day. Today's situation is a short daily show all about giving you the facts on what is today's holiday and its meaning, what is today's observance and its meaning, important historical events that occurred on this day and the reason for their importance, scientific discoveries and their impact on humanity, what is today's famous birthdays, what is today's famous passings, technological discoveries, and how they advanced humanity. Hey, it's all about learning and having fun. Let's get started. Famous holidays and observances for April 23rd. Today is a day of silence for a campaign that seeks to shed light on what many LGBTQ youth experience daily. Initially intended to focus on this problem within the school system, it has since expanded into workplaces, university campuses, and sporting events. Yearly, millions participate by staying silent for the duration of their day, representing the silencing of LGBTQ students. Today is Lover's Day. Although its origins are unknown, many countries have their own versions of Lover's Day. You have another chance of doing something great for your significant other if you struck out on Valentine's Day. Today is National Cherry Cheesecake Day. This dessert hits the spots for desserts. Cheesecake texture is nothing like regular cakes or sweetbreads. Indeed, its creamy, thick, pudding-like character comes from the soft cheese used as the main ingredient. Either regular cream cheese or cottage cheese is used. When the cheese is mixed with sugar, eggs, and other ingredients, the batter is added to a crust. Cherries are then placed atop the wonderful cheesecake. Mmm. Today is also World Book Night. It is the annual celebration of books and reading on April 23rd that brings people from all backgrounds together for one reason, to inspire others to read more. You can read more about it by clicking the link in the description below. Way. If you're enjoying this content, please remember to like and subscribe, and thank you. Now back to the commentary. In 215 BC, a temple built on the Capitoloni Hill was dedicated to Venus Erycina to commemorate the Romans being defeated at Lake Trasimene. In 1014, King Brian Boru of Ireland defeated Viking forces at the Battle of Clontarf, freeing Ireland from foreign control. In 1597, William Shakespeare's The Merry Wives of Windsor was first performed with Queen Elizabeth I of England in attendance. In 1861, Robert E. Lee was named Commander of Virginia Confederate Forces in the U.S. Civil War. In 1968, the first decimal coins were issued in Britain, five and ten new pence, replacing shilling and two shilling pieces. In 1984, the AIDS virus was identified as HTLV III, which stands for Acquired Immune Deficiency Syndrome. Famous Birthdays for April 23rd. April 23rd, 1564. William Shakespeare was born. He was an English playwright, poet, and actor. He is regarded as the greatest writer in the English language and the world's greatest dramatist. He wrote 39 plays, 154 sonnets, and many other amazing materials still used to this day. April 23rd, 1928. Shirley Temple was born. She was Hollywood's most famous child star. She was the leading Hollywood star between 1935 to 1938. Her most prominent films were Bright Eyes, Curly Top, and Heidi. April 23, 1977. John Cena was born. He is said to be considered the greatest and most popular wrestler. Outside of his wrestling career, John Cena has been a prolific actor and for his Make-A-Wish Foundation charity work. April 23, 2000. Chloe Kim was born. She is one of the most successful snowboarders of her generation. She is the youngest woman to win an Olympic snowboarding gold medal when she won in the women's snowboard halfpipe at Pyeongchang. She also achieved being the first woman to score a perfect 100 and the second rider to do so overall. Famous passings for April 23rd. April 23rd, 1616, William Shakespeare passed. He was born on April 23rd and passed on April 23rd. That's an incredible play on numbers there. After he passed, two of his fellow men published a collection of 36 of his plays 
In 1623, they published them in the first folio, which is a collection of plays by William Shakespeare, and thus preserving Shakespeare's works and ensuring his legacy along with being considered one of the most influential books ever published. April 23rd, Auguste Lorraine passed. He was a French chemist who laid the foundations of organic chemistry with his discoveries. He devised a systematic nomenclature for organic chemistry based on structural grouping of atoms within molecules to determine how the molecules combine in organic reactions. Truly amazing work. This has been today's situation. Thank you for joining us. See you next time.